Hi there, my name's Sam, and we are back here in Strange View. Uh, we are jumping here into the Singles household. In this household, we have an additional Sim. We have Mr. Rip Grunt. He's hanging out here. So there's some reasoning for this. It's kind of just a, a choice, a creative choice I made. Um, because when I was making over the house, I decided to go ahead and use like dorm doors for the for the rooms that's the various sims that are living here and i thought it kind of would be neat if this is almost sort of a, a a group home of some kind some kind of you know it's a lot of the younger kids of the of the town can if there's room in the ta in the house they can go come and live here and join the household so as you can see we do have a couple of doors still open um maybe some of the kids that finish the college will end up here if maybe if they're still single and don't really you know have anywhere to go on their own they can drop in here so that's kind of what i decided to do and that's why mr rip is here because he was by himself in an apartment and realistically the apartment was kind of expensive he was in the apartment that looks like condos but anyway we can look at we have miss chloe here she's usually a little bit of a troublemaker but um it's interesting she does have the want to get married now, I did put on, of course, her secondary, which she got a secondary of family. And actually, it looks like she now has a, a point to spend, so we'll have her spend it on that, I guess. Or do I want something else? Maybe we'll do that, I guess. But yeah, so she got family um, secondary, and she got this want to be married. Now, I don't recall... Who is this? Ashley Pitts. She's apparently in a relationship with Ashley Pitts. <laughs> but I think Ashley is a college kid. Maybe we should... Maybe we should play Ashley and have him graduate and stuff. I don't know. It'd be interesting. Maybe Lola will convince him. Or Chloe, rather. I'm, I'm going to get Chloe and Lola constantly screwed up. But maybe Chloe will convince him to drop out for her. <laughs> she she might be, would be like that. Now, Miss Lola, the, the cutie, who did not get enough attention last time. I do recall that. She's kind of looking down for us. Let me just hit play. She's very cute. Now, she... What was her secondary? She got the knowledge secondary, which seems pretty on brand for her. She's a little bit more um, clean cut than her sister. Ms. Lola um, has a very strong, <laughs> a very strong relationship with one famous Herboldy. And I really want a fresh herb baby. <laughs> I really, really want one. <laughs> And I think that should be kind of a goal. Now she wants to go on a date. And there's a very good chance these two have such good chemistry that if they end up on a date, they're gonna end up woohooing in some closet or in some thing. I don't know. For some reason, Herb just is obsessed with Lola. We have that going on. And then what are you? Uh oh, <laughs> she's booing him through the door. Okay. Okay. This is great. But so Rip. He got the secondary of family, which is I thought was kind of neat. So, of course, he's also a, a romance-slash-family sim. Chloe is a romance-slash-family sim. So that's kind of an interesting um, interesting little pair, little uh, similarity there, I guess. I don't think these... Well, oh, that's interesting. Him and Chloe have three bolts. That's very interesting. However, he does currently have an affair going on with Dina Goth. So that is also a factor. What do you want to do with yourself other than... Okay, she wants to have a party. Oh my gosh. That sound was ridiculous. Please stop. Oh, she also works... At... Okay, so these... Okay, wait. These two are very similar. She works in the slacker career as well. They both work in slacker. Just a, a level apart. Oh, you know what? This little cat... So apparently they adopted a cat. I don't, I don't know why, but it's stuck outside. Lola. We're going to say it's Lola's cat. She se it seems like it would be her cat. His name is Decker, apparently. Can you please bring cat in here? I think I put enough cat stuff everywhere. Yeah, I have a bowl in there. I'll have her fill a bowl. Fill the kitty bowl. I have a bed. Oh, we have a bed here. There we go. Okay, we've got, we've got our, our uh, kitty... Build up here. So, Ms. Uh, Lola is working in the law career as a paralegal. So, she needs cleaning and charisma. I'm kind of in the mood to help them get good at their jobs, ma'am. 
You get your skill point, bud. Okay, you need to hurry up here. Okay, you're done. Good job. What do you want to do with yourself? He wants a logic level. Buy a double bed. That's true. This house does not have a double bed. It does have a hot tub, so that's the that's kind of the woohoo opportunity. Other than like on the couch or something with ACR. Um, why are you just hanging out in Chloe's room? You're making it weird. What is going on? Being charmed? Wait. Lola's trying to charm Rip right now. Lola. Okay, she's attracted to Rip. Everybody likes Rip. <laughs> do I have... I do have all of his... Yeah, I have his whole tree here, so... Yeah, I think he's... Um... I think he's considered more attractive, too, because of it. Something in, in there does that. Okay, now I'm a... Now I don't know what's going on. I feel like these two ladies are going to be fighting over Rip this whole time. Here, you know what? You need your charisma. Everybody's everybody's doing skills for right now. It's been an afternoon of skilling. Let's see. Okay, she's swooning over him too. Uh-oh, these two girls are gonna both be flirting with him. This is gonna be awful. This is gonna be drama. Oh, okay. The talking didn't work. The attraction is merely physical. <laughs> also, somebody's calling. How about you stop? Where did I put the phone? Oh, it's over here. Answer the phone, please, Lola. Okay, yeah, let's just put the books all over the floor where the cat's gonna, like, chew them up or something. Watch it be Herb. Oh, it's Ashley calling for Chloe. Yeah, sure. Okay, they seem to be getting along here for a moment. Okay, she's got her on hold. You need to, you need to go answer the phone. Okay, yeah, he's got three bolts with Chloe, two with Lola. This is a lot. He wants logic. Do I have any way of... Oh, there is a chess table out here. Here, co come do some logic. Oh. Hey, I found some new places to hang out at downtown. Do you want to meet me there? Sure. Why not? I guess we're going to go on a date. She does want to get married. Um, we're not going to bring anybody with us. All right, then. I guess we've, we've got, we're going to go downtown with Chloe instead of Lola. Who's Goopy? Why are you here in a cop uniform? What, is, what are you doing? Lucky Shack, Lulu Lounge. I don't know what we want. Sure, let's go to the Lulu Lounge. We need to stop that. Go to community lot, please. There's a, a Officer Goopy on our front porch here. I don't know why he always is walking around in this uniform still. <laughs> He's like, he's on the beat. Goopy, Goopy on the beat. I really want to play Goopy and have him incorporated into a into a household at some point. I never I never get to play him. He's such an icon. He's just always a fleeting little townie going off into the distance. There he goes. He's gone. <laughs> Almost. Now he's gone. <laughs> Here we are. Is it just- oh. Oh boy, it's his whole- it's his whole- because he's part of like a fraternity. <laughs> Oh no! The whole fraternity came! Not this! Look at th okay. Maybe we, maybe we should play the fraternity as part of the round and get them all graduated and stuff. Yeah, he's very into- she's heads right for the bar. She doesn't even talk to him. Who's this? Oh, this is Angela Pleasant. Hello, Angela. Uh-oh, this- Joshua just, like, woo wooed at her, too. Like, wh whistled at her. Are they all- oh no. <laughs> <laughs> this is a, they're, they're all losers that can't get a date, so they all came on this date, and they all just want her. <laughs> this is, makes it weird. Ashley's not bad looking. He's a good looking Sim. Look at him. Look at this. <laughs> not all of the oh, not all of the college boys wanted Chloe. This is not it. What does she want? She wants to. I guess this isn't officially a date with them yet, so I I think I can ask on date. Okay, so we are officially on a date. What are his wants? Slow dance, play, dance, talk. Oh, you're just exciting there, Ashley. Very wholesome. I like the two little curious sisters. I think they're really cute. I think they're... Not him, like... Oh no, he's into Angela right in front of her. How rude. How rude. Look, she looked right at me. Looked right in the camera. Like, are you serious? Is this guy for real? I'm gonna do a little back rub. 
Is she going to propose to Ashley tonight? What do you think he would do? I think I have some stuff that lets it happen between young adult and adult if it doesn't naturally in game. But I feel like that means we would need to, to play Ashley. Oh, she wants to woohoo with Ashley. Can we woohoo with Ashley? Woohoo sofa. That's the only option. Where's the. So oh. Are we gonna have to woo. Are we gonna woohoo over here? Will, will it happen? Oh. Okay. Right at the entrance. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, what did I expect exactly? <laughs> okay. They just keep like hopping on each. Oh. Okay. There it goes. All right. Who's over here? Oh. Goopy has resurfaced. <laughs> Who else is here? Brittany Upsnot. I think she's a college kid. Her mesh on her shirt's screwed up. I don't know what's going on. Sandy Fairchild, Mr. Goopy in his uniform. I feel like that's not a real uniform. I feel like he's just wearing a uniform. Oh, Angela's in the... Angela's in here. Okay. I can't wait to play Angela and Tank at one point. At some point. Of course, An yeah, and... Oh. Hello. Hello, vampire. Contessa Dahlia... Porthos. Or Portos. Alright, anyway, these two are done and they're just going to town over here on each other. He wants to woohoo with her now. I'm gonna lock that in. Maybe they'll go back to their house, her house together or something. Should she propose to him? I'm debating. I'm debating. They're just, they're, they're having a blast together, it seems like. They're already at dream date. They have really good chemistry. I'm just gonna- she wants to get married. I'm gonna do it. Let's see. Do you think he's gonna- what, what if he rejects it? I think he's gonna reject it. Oh god. <gasps> Oof. Well, I did real good at- I, I just did a great job at ruining that date in 0.5 seconds. I love how it only brought it down a couple notches. <laughs> she does, She's right back at it. Okay. Yeah, that was a big N.O. from him. Also, he's a, a romance him. Who's this? Sarah McCarthy? Why are we doing this? Who's this? Oh, ask Ashley home. Why don't we do that? We'll lock that in. We can ask Ashley home. We're kind of just... I don't even know... Oh, there is a hot tub out here. All of all of his uh, dude bros are just chilling in the hot tub. You want to ride home? Back to my place. I think that's what it counts as. Ask Ashley home. Back to my place. Yes. Look at this walk she's doing. You see the strut? Wait, we need to turn on the lights in this room. Look at the strut. <laughs> she's strutting. She's feeling it. Okay. Ask him back to your place. Okay, he's coming back to the place with us. Are we immediately leaving back to the place? How does that work? Is the, ta is the taxi coming? Hmm, so it seems like nothing happened. Call taxi? He said back to my place. Does that just mean like he's part of our, our group and will come back with us when we go? Seems like he's walking out to the telephone with us. Oh, okay. Here comes, here's taxi. Looks like he's going with us, so that's good. You better be jumping in here, Ashley. Good job. There we go. Okay. So we are back on the lot. Um, oh, interesting. Um, it appears the visitor contr or the time mod did not work. Community time mod. So we're back here. I don't know what why that did that. It has to do with a college kid or what. She does want a woohoo in hot tub. I think I need to uh, go ahead and lock that in. Let's get in the hot tub. Of course, Ashley's going right for the keg. That's he's he's just gotta. He's just gotta. Ew. Ashley, would you like to join? How do we? Yes, ask to join, please. Come join. Yes, put the cup on the. That's very that's very respectful of you, Ashley. Are you not getting in? No. Yes. <laughs> You're you're a real uh, roller coaster ride, Ashley. All right. Well, we're back up to dream date. Despite the failed engagement, <laughs> our timer's running out, but that's all right because it's we're we're at dream date. Rip, don't 
don't watch. Don't go 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 away, Rip. We're, we're having a private moment. Look, you already got whatever skill point you wanted, I think. Okay, you already want more skill points. He just has all kinds of wants for learning stuff. That's interesting. He's in the mood to learn stuff. Come and eat spaghetti. Lola made some nice spaghetti. And nobody... Nobody's, uh, you know, respecting the spaghetti. Okay, Lola, if you're... Oh my gosh, you're so tired. If you're this tired, okay, our date's about to run out. I'm gonna have her, like, say goodbye to him. She's super duper tired. I assume he'll leave. Now that's what I'm talking about. Put the dream in dream date. Alright. Say goodbye to Ashley. She's still doing the strut walk. Oh my gosh, she has to go to work? Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Just in time. Well, you know what? I did bump up her energy a little bit. Also, she did not officially say goodbye to Ashley, so he is now um, mo eating our spaghetti. Ashley, where are you going? <laughs> where are you going in your swim trunks, Ashley? <laughs> anyway... I just want him to chat with Dina at 11 o'clock at night. Maybe she'll be mad at him. It can, he's just gonna get in a cheeky little secret call at 11 p.m. Mortimer went to sleep. She's gonna, he's gonna call his dream woman. Not the, not the baby talk. Alright, ma'am. You must be, you're getting tired. You know what, Lola can put things in order here. Well, you know what? Ashley is not her problem. She's not gonna put things in order. I was gonna have her say goodbye to Ashley, but you know what? She's she is simply not her problem. Are you leaving, Ashley? Are you say I oh nope, I don't think you're leaving. Are going to um litter the backyard with plastic cups? Yep, looks like that's what's gonna happen. Who are you? Who's this dog? Okay. <laughs> okay, buddy. Oh, okay. Ms. Uh, Ms. Chloe has arrived home from work. I think Ashley left on his own at some point in the night while everybody else was sleeping. Poor Ms. Uh, Chloe is very tired. The part of the household is awakening. <laughs> Rip and Lola got up at the same time. Ms. Lola, what do you got going on here? You got all kinds of wants. Not... Rip... Okay. Well, it doesn't seem to interrupt the Sims, surprisingly. But he walked in, whistled at her, and then started playing guitar in her face. Oh. That's very good. That's that's very respectful of him. Oh, I had a kitty. Give love. Feed a treat. Where are you taking cat? Or how long till the cat grows up? Oh, a little while. Four days. Okay, she's like feeding him treats. Like crazy. Oh, he needs- f how did he eat all of that food so quickly? Also, let's clean up all our messes. Do not lick clean. <laughs> In his purple robe. It's got the- I have a collection of robes that have all the zodiac signs on them. So some of the sims I bought the ones that correspond with their zodiac sign. So his is purple, apparently, because he's a Sagittarius. <laughs> oh, there is the carpool. Ma'am, please exit the tub. There she go. Look at her business suit, her law outfit. Oh, we got a uh, we got a thingy. I'm assuming that's from Chloe. Here, are you? I mean, from Ashley for Chloe. Stop playing the guitar for a little while. He wants to go on a date. Everybody in this household is just going to be going off on dates. I love. I kind of love that though. But I think that he should go on a date with Dina. <laughs> I think. I don't know who else. No. I mean, Chloe and him, he could, I mean, him and Chloe could have a thing, because they're both romance sims also. Him and Lucy, when they were young, had like a thing together. Okay. <laughs> I just got Cirque Beaker stealing our newspaper. It's, it's, you can't see it, but, but it's there. Okay, Cirque thanks. There you go, good job, buddy, you finished your cereal. Maybe him and, um, him and Dina will go on a little daytime date. That seems a little risky. But, or should he invite her here, or should they go somewhere? I feel like they should just go somewhere. We can also test to see if the community time mod works for them or not. Let's talk to Miss Dina. Oh no. 
<laughs> oh no. Uh, Mortimer says, You should try calling back when Dina isn't at work. I'm guessing Rip didn't quite announce his, his uh, reasons. <laughs> that was a close one, Rip. Also, I didn't remember that Dina had a job. I forgot that. Maybe, maybe Ashley is not the one for her to marry. But who could it be? I mean, she's a romance sim, so realistically, whenever, whoever she marries is not going to be the only one she's in a relationship with. I think maybe we should try her and Rip and see how they get along. So she wants to woohoo with three different sims, make out with three different sims. I'm going to lock in, get married. I still want to keep get married locked in. I think that's an interesting want for her. But also the woohoo. Um, I'm gonna let's look at all these look at all these bolts. Why don't we let's let's try to lay it down on Mr. Rip here, why not? She's got a, a prime uh victim here right in front of her. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. I feel like even just leaving them here for a second, ACR might take over. I'm just curious. I always like it when ACR does it instead of me. Where are we going? What are we doing? Oh. We're stepping into the kitchen for a back rub. <laughs> Apparently. Whoa. Whoa, that's a lot. Why do we have so much money? Oh, wait. Oh my gosh. I guess it's just because I had moved him into this house or something. Okay. Apparently they're they're like richy rich. I'm gonna fix it. There we go. I fixed their money back down to a more reasonable amount, but apparently they lost two thousand dollars of um, in the stock market. I'm assuming that's Lola's doing. <laughs> she seems like the only one playing the stock market around here. Anyway, Lola's home, and I kind of would like to also. Rip and Chloe throughout the day got distracted with their needs, and they stopped kind of flirting. I don't know. I, I planted the seed. We'll see if they take off on their own. I don't know. Or if I'll, I'll kind of force it again. She's jumping in the tub. But then I would like for her to call up her good old buddy, little Herbie. And they go on a date together. Let's go to a community lot, Herb. No, we're not taking anyone with us. Oh boy. Where are we gonna go? I feel like maybe we could stay in Strange View. I like how every time... Oh, okay. She... Oh, okay. Well, I was gonna... There's something happening up there, but let's see. What are we gonna do? We don't really have anywhere to go there. Okay. So, here's the thing I forgot to share. <laughs> One of the de like the pre-made community lots in Pleasant View, I have a, uh, a freshly made over version of it, and I was gonna work on maybe doing some of the others. So why don't we why don't we visit the freshly made over pre-made lot for Pleasant View? It's 250 Main Street is what it's called. But anyway, she was she was like swooning him while he she sat here and watched him play guitar. I love how I was gonna say I love how he his guitar playing is always very like chill. Let's stop. Take a break. If you two, yeah. Look at these two. Maybe they're the marriage couple. They're the couple. They could be a cup because they're both family and romance sims. They could both be like understanding of an open relationship with no jealousy or something. Like that I feel like that could be fun for those two. Okay. Here we are at 250 Main Street. A funky little makeover of the lot. It's being a little laggy as it loads in here. This is the lot. It is the pool lot. Kind of fun. It's got some fun little uh, displays here with a funky little cactus in it. Got one in each corner. I'm just going to hit play and let them load in here. That's got a fun little bingo machine up here. What else do we have? We got, we got a little game machine. Not a machine, a game table. Um, Go down here. Got the little... Bathrooms and showers and everything. Yeah, got a little workout zone. Yep, and of course we got the pool. Um, oh, we're going right to the little bingo machine. I'm getting a lot of lag on this slot right now. I don't know why exactly. Where's the man of the hour? Where is Herb? Oh, there's Herb. Herb, are you are you coming up to play bingo? <laughs> is this a date with Herb? <laughs> date with Herb equals playing bingo. 
<laughs> at the local community a lot. Is that what we're doing? Are you not gonna play bingo with us, Herb? Was it all a lie? Okay. Well, we need to not waste our, our date time standing here in front of the bingo machine. What do you want to do to Herb? He wants to entertain him. Tell him a dirty joke. He wants to woohoo with ten different sims. He wants to dance with Lola, play with Lola, talk to Lola. Okay, it's very dark in this little corridor. I'm, I'm certain I had outdoor lights, but apparently not up here. Okay. Ooh. Get married to Herb! What? <laughs> Lola, you realize he's married as it is, right? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> is this happening? Wait a minute. But how can that... What happens if... Okay, we need some... We're just gonna do some romantic stuff first. We need to just encourage some romantic actions. Oh, now she's got the woohoo want. There it is. Oh, he just got it too. Look at that. No, we're not gonna- we'll lock in that. Can they woohoo somewhere on this lot? I assume- yeah, just sofa. <laughs> I need to offer more options. Wait. Oh, wait. Wait. Ugh. They can do it in the lo in the- I almost said the locker. This thing. I'm gonna hit try for baby. <laughs> Running out of time for an herb baby. I'm hitting try for baby. I'm doing it. I don't care. I'm making it happen. <laughs> oh no, not the va- wait. Get out of vamp- get out vampire, we have business. <laughs> get out vampire. Okay. There it is. This is awkward, dark. Lola, I'm just gonna say- oh, no, she's hitting the button and opened it up on him. Oh no, this man, he's having a reaction. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> he's horrified. <laughs> okay. <gasps> this man! Frank just- Frank just- even Frank is into Herb. This random townie guy. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> what is this? Look at them smushing their faces together as they're looking at the rain. That's- that's true love. Uh oh. This is Crumple Bottoms here. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> I have no words. <laughs> I have no words. I wish it wasn't so dark here right now. This is- there's a lot to unpack in this picture. Let's go here. Go downstairs. Um, we're gonna just do some more schmoozing of the herb. Of the herbie. Yeah, let's make out among all the sweaty, gross townies. That's romantic. That's romantic. What does he want? He wants to get a back rub. Uh, let's serenade herb in the local uh, community workout room. The free gym. Oh, we're going elsewhere here. She also got the want to woohoo with him again. Um, I think I should- I think I might have him do it again in an elevator. We're gonna have him try for baby for safe measure. I want an herb baby. We need an alien herb. Alien herb. There they go. <laughs> oh my gosh, that lightning completely whited out the screen. They haven't quite got to dream date level yet, which is interesting considering, you know, what's happening in front of us right now. <laughs> the the bell ringing. Okay. We have our- this is a very, uh, very intense date with Herb here. He wants to make out. There we go, we got to dream date. Ask Herb home. You know what? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh-oh. <laughs> we have another uh, little uh, moment happening here. Okay, Miss Crumblebottom. Thanks for your input. Hello, Ivy Cooper. Okay. See, now that uh, back to my place worked because she actually is prompted to go to call a taxi on her own after I had her say back to my place. That's interesting. That's somebody else swooning over Herb. Herb. <laughs> Everybody that walks by swoons over Herb. He's just irresistible. It's gonna be so sad the day that Herb dies. I think he's older than Coral, so he's gonna go before Coral. Which is why we need a little miniature Herb running around. Oh, no, no, that's some pink. That pink just went by. Okay, this his man's got a pink cape. This is a bad sign. You might have to do a little restart of the game here. 
We are going up on one hour of recording, though, so... Look at that beautiful pink. And once again, is the community time mod... Nope, the community time mod did not work once again. That's interesting. Interesting. Um, we don't seem to have any pink flashing. Right now, at least. Seems to have calmed down. So I think we'll finish off our date with Herbie. And that might be the end of this episode. Who are you calling, buddy? Oh, he's answering the phone. Yeah, sure. It's Ashley calling for Chloe again. Okay. These two just headed right for the hot tub. <laughs> that's that's fine. <laughs> Herb, look at you in your little old man boxer short. I okay. I don't what do you see in him, Lola? I need to know. That's the that's the that's the fun of Herb is what do they all see in him? <laughs> Because we can't find it. What are we doing? We're doing a make-out. A little make-out session. I love how he's sitting on her lap. <laughs> oh. Ma'am? Okay, she's just kind of choosing to ignore the phone call. I feel like it's going to be gone by the time she gets to it. Oh. Oh, he hung up and somebody else called and she doesn't really want to talk to him. Who are you talking to? Oh, Janie Forrest. Alright. Go downtown? No, we're not going to go downtown again. Here. Let's do a romantic kiss and see what happens. For the heck of it. <laughs> I think these two need to be a thing. They just, they seem like they would be a fun, uh, very, uh, open couple here. Very op very modern couple. Okay, okay, well that like immediately bumped him right into crush mode. Oh, who's on the bubbler? Okay. Little Herb is on the bubbler. These two are just having a blast out here. Wow, that was the best time I ever had with anybody. I really want to go out again. I bet that's what you say to all your ladies, Herb. I bet that's what you say to all your ladies. Final kiss. You better be pregnant, Lola. Okay, I'm, he's still hanging around, so we'll just let him hang. Why are we fighting over... Who's, why are you drinking an invisible cup? Okay. He's also got an invisible cup. Uh, what? Uh. <laughs> oh no. I didn't want you pregnant, Chloe. I wanted your sister. <laughs> Whose baby does she have? Is, she, is it Ashley's baby? Would it be that quick? I guess. It's just been a day. Did she get the first bump in a day? Okay. I think we need to do some resets because our um, hands are stuck. Okay. I accidentally deleted Chloe. <laughs> um, I was trying to re I hit reset, I thought. Let me, um... Let me just save and, and reload the lot. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's happening. I hit reset. Is Herb still here? Did Herb leave? No, Herb's still hanging around. I had to reset her because her hand was stuck in the thing, so I went to reset her and now it doesn't show her as pregnant. I'm confused. She must still be and she's probably just gonna change again. I guess we'll see what happens. I wouldn't think it would have, like, just resetting her would have terminated a pregnancy. Okay, according to according to the Sim Blender, it's still identifying Chloe as pregnant. So, she, it's just that maybe she didn't technically get her bump or it got set back or something. We'll, we'll see what happens. Anyway, Herb, Herb's still here. Maybe, maybe before you go to bed you should say goodbye to her, Herb. No, I said... Say goodbye. I know he's just irresistible, little little old man. Goodbye. Okay, as soon as Herb leaves, she starts swooning over Rip. Okay. Um, so I think we're gonna go ahead and leave this episode here. This was a fun jump back into this household. It's a very uh, there's a lot of different romantic things happening. Um, hopefully our pregnancies continue. Hopefully we have one here and this one continues. I don't know what, what happened. The game's having its moment. But yeah, I guess that's it for now and I'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye. Ta -da!